Mr. Speaker, the Interparliamentary Alliance on China, IPAC, made up of 30 other lawmakers from 16 global legislatures, today published alongside AP research from Professor Adrian Zenz, the world's leading expert on treatment of minorities in Xinjiang province. The report shows that the birth rates of the two of mostly Uyghur regions plummeted by more than 60% from 2015 to 2018. Across the Xinjiang region, birth rates fell nearly 24% in one single year, compared to just 4.2% in the nation as a whole. Worse, it's now clear this is directly the result of government actions. For unearthed documents, uh, these are government documents, mandate that birth control violations that come about due, and I quote this, due to the influence of extreme religious thinking should be, quote, dealt with severely, and those unable to pay fines should be dealt with through coercive measures. These are in the documents, and including internment. Now, Mr. Zen's paper concludes that these are part of a statewide crackdown which includes mass sterilization of women. This report corroborates the many horrific personal testimonies many of us have heard. The Genocide Convention maintains that birth prevention targeted at minority groups is indicative of genocide, and the Convention binds individual states to act, not just rely on the international judicial system. Therefore, does my right honourable friend agree with me that the Uyghur people have been and are victims of mass atrocity crimes? I ask that the Foreign Secretary go to the UN and call for an independent inquiry, but I also sadly recognise, Mr Speaker, that there are ways to deal with this through the UN are almost certainly going to be blocked by China. So given that likelihood, will my right honourable friend at least get the UK to make its own legal determination after weighing up this new evidence?